Hey y'all, this is Brandy from Southern Crafts DIY. Why? Sorry. And I want to say hey to all my returning viewers and welcome to any new viewers. And I just want to let y'all know if y'all follow me on social media, which links are down below, you'll have seen a list of everything needed for today's project. You can even get that list on the community tab. So what we're doing is just a cute, fun little decor piece for the 4th of July. It is something that popped in my head when I actually saw the star on this piece of board that I got from Dollar Tree last year I believe it was it could have been a year before I'm not 100% sure but if you can't find one like this you can just pick one you know however you want so what we are gonna do is we are just gonna make a simple sign so let me get right to it and jump into what's needed for this project all right so the first thing you're gonna need is a piece of board like this and then you're gonna need some paint I am using Snow White by Waverly and I am going to use my Imperial Paint by Folk Art. And then I'm going to be using Ocean by Waverly. So that's red, white, and blue, as you can guess. And then, of course, you know, some paint brushes. This I'm going to be using to paint the backdrop. And this I'm going to be using for the design. All right, so let's get to it. All right, y'all, so I thought about this long and hard about how I want to use the colors and I'm going to use the white to paint this side there go. so that is my first step I originally thought maybe blue but I don't want I just didn't want that color you can even leave it black and paint all use all three colors to be the fireworks and the black could be like the night sky but I just want I wanted a white background so I'm more than likely gonna have to do more than one coat because I am painting over black and this is white but you got to get the base down first before you worry about putting another coat on. So just paint the whole thing. If you decide to paint it. Like I said, y'all can do different than me. You want to be creative and make this your own. It just makes it so much better. Like I said, the first coat does not have to look perfect. You just want to get it basically on there so that when you go over it again, it's covering the white. So that's all I'm doing. want to get paint on my little thingy my hanger so I'm going to take that out give me a 
second. One side doesn't want to come out. See what I want, not what you want, dang it. Give me a second, y'all. Alright, so now I'm just gonna finish painting it. It's almost done. And then when it dries, I'll do the second coat. gonna let this dry now and then I'll move on to second coat all right y'all it's dry and of course I painted both sides because that's how I do it so now we're gonna move on to the next step and I am actually just gonna sketch it out with a pencil and then go from there so what I want to do is I want to make it look like fireworks are exploding and I need some little fireworks down here so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna take and I'm gonna draw some little firework things and it doesn't have to be perfect it's just my idea what they're gonna look like So, that is what I'm doing, and I'm just going to leave it like that. It doesn't have to be perfect. I know this is going off to the side, but it'll be fun. So, I'm going to take that, and that's going to be where the fireworks come from. And then I'm just going to take, and it's not going to be perfect, you know. So... But we're going to take, we're just going to draw how it's going to look. That's my attempt at a firework, y'all. I don't know. But we're just going to, you know. Do you like that? And we're just going to do a bunch of different fireworks. If I get where you see it, I'm sorry. I don't know if you can see this because I am just drawing in a pencil. But you will get to see it in um, paint when I'm done. So. I'm very picky how I like my stuff to look. And then we're just going to do several different ones. Oops. I don't know. I'm not the greatest at this, so I'm just trying to do what I think will look best. And we just drawing it around. Give me a second. You know what the problem is? I think I'm making it too big in the middle. So we're going to go back and we're going to fix it. Give me a second. Alright, I like the way that looks better. It's not perfect, but you know, I can see it as a firework. So I'm just going to continue and I'm going to do a couple of them, like right up here instead of down there where I had it. And 
I erased it. You can still see it. You go over that with white paint when you're done. Just touch it up so you don't see the pencil marks. So I'm just going to come up here. I'm going to do like that. I'm already not liking it. <laughs> I'm just trying to I'm not trying to make them look exact but you know I do want to make it look like a firework y'all more I don't know y'all I like it it's not perfect but I like it I think the idea comes across so I'm going to do one up here maybe a few down here lower y'all get the idea of what I'm doing. Alright, so that's up there. I don't know if y'all can see it. And I'm just going to do a few down here. I know this is lower than that, but it's fine. It's supposed to be background anyways. It looks like a spider, but it works. <laughs> so you just want to do this in a bunch of different spots just to make it look firecrackery. And I'm doing this because when I go to paint it, I want it to look the way I want it to look. It's supposed to be more of an angle. There we go. I'm just making them up as I go pretty much. Alright. So I'm going to go with that and we'll see where it goes. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and paint these down here. And what I'm going to do, hold on y'all. All right, sorry about that. So I'm going to paint these. And it doesn't matter. I'm I am just literally doing red, white and blue. Red, white and blue. So those are the colors I'm using. You can pick whatever colors you want. I'll probably add some black for the wicks cuz I decided to do those. But 
you know, I'm not doing a bunch of colors on this. It's supposed to be a 4th of July, and I'm doing the traditional colors, red, white, blue. So, but again, this is your sign. You can pick whatever colors you want. So, just go ahead and paint it. So I'm going to let that dry and I'm going to move on to the next color and then I'll go from there because I have some touch-ups I want to do with it. I think I want to do like blue stripes on the red one and red stripes on the blue one, but it's got to dry first before you can do any of that. So. Give me a second. Oh, we almost forgot to start filming before I started painting. This is not exactly the color blue I wanted, but it works. I wanted a brighter blue, but I don't have a brighter blue. You know, not a light blue either. I'm going to do bright dark blue. But sometimes you get stuck with colors and it'll work. Like I said, it's still blue. Not the blue I envisioned, but it's fine. So. Gotta let that dry. I'm not the best with doing this stuff, but it's just the thought, you know. There. So that's my red one with the blue on it, and then I'll do the blue with the red on it as soon as the blue dries. So I would love to hear y'all's feedback on this, what y'all think of it. As we're going through. I'm sorry, y'all. Alright, so now to move on. And I was thinking about it. And this I think I'm going to paint black too. That was not the plan. But... It should be fine. So. You can also do those yellow instead of black. So that's an option also. See how they're lit.
and this is all open interpretation I was going to do this I think red and I changed my mind so I mean if you want to do the red like I was originally going to do or even blue that is totally fine this was just an last minute deciding I wanted to do it that color so there are those and then I will move on to the next so to do this I'm just going to take my paintbrush my little detail one and I'm just going to paint over my lines and hope it comes out looking good Just trying to give it a little color. And just do this however you feel you like it. Because this is ultimately to please yourself. And even if you're giving it as a gift, you know, you're supposed to show them how much you enjoyed making it by doing something that you'd like. It's a labor of love, not a labor of, ugh, I just gotta do this. So. I hope y'all are enjoying this because I, I do like how it's coming out. And you also don't have to mix colors like this. You can do one firework the whole color. Like red or blue. So. So I think that going to be my red also 
I mean, I think that's going to be it for my red. I'm just adding a few. And have fun with it, you know? <clears throat> Don't second guess yourself. So that's going to be my red. I'm going to leave it like that. And then I'm going to move to my blue. Alright, so the what's left over is going to be blue. <laughs> I should really learn how to work from the top to the bottom, but it's okay. So I'm liking this so far. It looks good. It doesn't have to be perfect either. Because I can tell you right now, I made some mistakes even in the drawing. But for the most part, I'm happy with it. I'm going to flip it over so I can get to this side. Easier. <laughs> And literally, there you go. And I was thinking about just adding some more dots. But I don't know. I don't want to. No, I'm not going to do it. I like it the way it is. So, I'm going to clean it up with some white paint. And go from there. So. I'll let you see it when it's finished. I'm sorry, I forgot to mention. you got to put your string back in there to hold it. So you have a hanger. And you don't have to use this. If you don't like this, you can easily get some 4th of July string. But that's it. It is done. Let me show you it all. Hold on. Let me show it to you all the way up. Look at that. I absolutely love it. I think it came out looking really great. I hope y'all enjoyed it too. But as I as you know, 
that's it for today's project i had so much fun making this i can't wait to display it for the fourth i hope y'all enjoyed it too and if y'all did please 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 like share subscribe and comment down below because it does help my channel to grow and it lets me know y'all are enjoying what i'm doing so i will see y'all next time bye